All right, this is the second video <clears throat> setting up the Rocket 5 AC light. Um, had a little discovery issue yesterday trying to get to one unit to talk to the other. And the whole part of it was, well, first off, let me go to the settings on each one and explain it there better. So basically, my first unit on the 0 0.21 IP address the main unit, which I call the bridge, is has to be set to access point, point to multipoint. There's two different versions, but I'm using the Airmax AC because both are all four of these units are Airmax AC radios. And the second unit, third, and fourth units have to be set to station point to multipoint. But the problem was is that the unit here actually had a more narrow channel um, selection than the first unit I had. The first three actually were all the same. It had a wide center freak, a wide um, control frequency range. What happened is I had this thing on auto to begin with, and um, it was picking a center frequency that was out of the range of the second rocket AC and what it is is if you go to your system tab the revised uni rules you have to activate and request um, unique activation code and apply it here to get those wider frequencies so why we had four units with only one was the narrow range I don't know but basically I spent two hours on that yesterday working on it um, so Anyways, long story short, I finally got them working by setting the center frequency in the range that the other ones can work in. And then uh, everything came up fine. So once they are working, I basically um, did a select, found the UBNT from the, pr the primary unit, um, selected lock to Mac just as a security. And then I have all four units set to secure you with a strong pre-share key to lock down the system as good as possible. The only other, um, everything else is default, except for the data rate. I changed to eight times. Um, the bridge unit, I did have to turn off defaults on this one because when it was picking a frequency, picked one that the others weren't on so I forced the center frequency and the control frequency to um, something that was in range of the other unit and besides that all I did was plug in the antenna on both units and the others I turned the power way down on both units um, what else did I do anything else I don't think oh uh, well I did the static settings but yesterday I was showing the uh, had them static so that they're on my local network so I can um, so that the units can go out to the Ubiquity website and update the firmware. So I have them all updated. And basically now I can put these on the IP addresses static for the customer. So I think that's about it. Thanks for watching and have a great day.